So hey guys, as you might have guessed, I've come down to Point Lonsdale again, and we've got our Life Saving Club Champs on tomorrow morning, so I'm only going to be competing in that, we'll see how it goes. Uh, in the meantime though, I might, it's almost getting dark now, so I might get out and have a quick flight, get some really good shots in the sunset, uh, probably along the beach as well. In the meantime, I'm just kind of uh, trying to tune up, tune up my new board. I wrote it for the first time today, and it's like designed for a lot of people. So the trucks were extremely loose. Um, it says here, maximum, hang on, let's see if I can get this. Maximum load, 20 to 100 kilos. How do you have a maximum load that's between 20 and 100? Wouldn't it just be 100 kilos? Like, yeah. Um, anyway, trucks are tightened. I'm gonna give this another shot. like a really small gap between the camera and my car so I keep coming very close to hitting it. Alright, board is good. Very flat soda water. Yeah, I haven't had a drink since New Year's and I'm kind of enjoying it, so I'm gonna try and be healthy and not drink for a while. Soda water tonight instead of beer. Cheers. Championships is over. I think I did pretty well. Uh, there's another event on now, so I'm just kind of hanging around for that. I don't think I'll compete in it. I'm going to help out with it. Everyone else seems to have left. There wasn't really many people, that's why I did well. Club champs, but yeah. Now just to wait around in this wonderful weather. All right, so I finished Club Champs and uh, the Bernie Cook Handicap Race, and it was a fun day. I Came first in a few things, so it was good. So now it's time to go home, have a shower, and then teach another course. So there we go, had my shower, and now time to teach a course. If you can see it up on the screen there, that's what I'm teaching, the radio operator certificate. I think it's probably blurry, but whatever. Um, yeah, I'm teaching it at two o'clock, it's now 20 past one, so I'm just sitting around waiting for everyone to arrive. <sighs> Not much to do right now. While I'm waiting, why don't I take you around the club and show you around? So out the front, this is like the front door of our clubhouse. Usually it's locked, but I've opened it up at the moment so everyone can arrive. Coming in. This is our club's main hall, so you can see projector, we've got a screen, nice big space, usually used for practicing some theory stuff. Um, and behind me over here is the office. 
kitchen in here, just full of stuff. That's usually pretty messy in there. And then over here, we have the junior lounge. So that's where all the kids can hang out. First ball, TV, stuff like that, table tennis. So table tennis bats, but I don't even think we have a table. These chairs are kind of cool. What next? There used to be a female bunk room right here, but we don't have like accommodation facilities anymore, so that's gone. This used to be the male bunk room, but now it's storage. We got lots of memorabilia, heap more upstairs. We've got a great club historian that's great at sort of uh, putting all that stuff together. And this is the plans for a new clubhouse. Hopefully in the next couple of years. <laughs> Upstairs we have the club bar, which is where I'm teaching, so yep, this space here. TV. You can see on the walls all around, there's a lot more memorabilia. All of our life members each get one of these frames, tells us about them. A couple of like competitions we've won. All of the old committee members. New committee members are on that board over there. I think that's about right. Out on the balcony, great place for a couple of drinks. And we've got our pop-up restaurant down here. So ice cream down there and other stuff there. They sell potato wedges and a few other things. Usually some pretty good food. Look, my name. When was this? Nine years ago I won. So there and then it'll be me again down there. Also back here when I was under 19. So yeah, hope you enjoy the tour of the club. It's a pretty, it's all right club, bit run down. We're getting a new one soon, but yeah, that's it. Now just to wait until the course starts. All right, I've been just my part of the radio course. Now my brother is assessing it. So I've got to head over the hill now to assess the spinal course that he's been helping out with because you can't assess and train the same course, so we've got to switch over. <sighs> Done for the day, how do you feel? <laughs> Happy days. So what was that? We had how many kids doing the spinal? 23. 23 kids doing spinal. 23 14 14 doing radios. Plus we had the club champs and Bernie Cook Grace this morning, so it's been a long day. And, and we all survived, and we're in for a rare treat. We have the Hoff gonna drive us back over the clubhouse. Here he is, the Hoff. At your service. Look at that. <laughs> Turns out we weren't done, there's paperwork to do as well. All the paperwork is done, assessments are all done. Well, he's still doing some paperwork. Yeah. But now that it looks like the pop-up restaurant is open, I think that's good enough for today. Catch you guys later.